Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Joey K. And guess what? It's mail call. That's right. Let's see what came in the mail today. Have it right over here. Hope everybody's doing good, doing awesome. Looks like another record. I tell you, I've been uh, very blessed and getting these great deals online and finding these uh, records. I can't wait to see what it is. What about you? <laughs> Let's take a look. Picked it up on Amazon. And if you don't know about, if you're into jazz and you know about Blue Note, or if you don't know about Blue Note, check it out. Blue Note has been just mind blown. Uh, all the new releases that they've been doing and the quality, if you're into that 50s, 60s, classic jazz, man, I'm telling you, this is a great time to find them online and just make that purchase. And then and, um, Blue Note, not too expensive. Oh, check, check, check it out. Who's that? Hank Mobley. This is the 1960 album, LP, Soul Station. If you're in the uh, bebop, this is some, this is some right here. This is some classic bebop. Hank Mobley, known as the middleweight uh, saxophone, because John Coltrane, he had more of a heavy sound, so Hank Mobley, they called him the middleweight. But that doesn't take nothing from how my man can play. Hank Mobley, 1960 Soul Station. What's that? Oh, yeah, it, this is not the Blue Note version. I, Man, I would love to get the Blue Note version. Um, there, the Blue Note, uh, the Blue Note version of this Soul Station, man, expensive, expensive, expensive. Could not, I can't touch it, can't touch it. My mouse won't click on it. <laughs> this is Jazz Images, Images, Jazz Images. Check out, check out the hype stickers right there. Hey, hey! I know I would I would love to have this album, uh, the Blue Note version, but this right here is just some classic bebop, high energy, uh, jazz tunes. Uh, I sample this on one of the the streaming uh, streaming sites, and I'm just man. I heard this and then I seen it in wax. Ooh -hoo -hoo. <laughs> oh man! And then I came across this one here. This is not, this this must be like a European uh, knockoff, you could say, could say. But I got it on Amazon, so I'm going to give this a listen. I hope this sounds good. hope it sounds decent. I mean, it's it's not one of those high-end uh, versions, but man, I can't wait. What's that? Oh, we got a narrator today. You want to do what? Hi, Mr. Narrator. Hi, Joey K. Yeah, you're going to tell us. The, narr the narrator is going to tell us a little bit more about this album. This is Blue Note 1960, Hank Moby's LP, titled Soul Station. Moby playing tenor saxophone featured just a rhythm section, one that happened to be the best in the air with pianists Winton Kelly, Paul Chambers on bass, working regularly with Hank Mobley in the Miles Davis Band. The dynamic, talented drummer Art Blanky with so much charisma in holding down the time on this LP Soul Station. This is truly a classic <laughs> bebop album. What's that? Oh, you want to see what it looks like? Let's do it. Let's take a look at this. Jazz images. Think I'm going to lose the hype sticker. Somehow I got to keep it. <laughs> I don't know if you're like that too, but I want to keep it in its original form. 
That's right. If you want a definitely Harvey serving of that 60s bebop, well, this is your meat and potatoes. Hank Mobley's 1960 Soul Station. Rudy Van Giller, Eaglewood Cliffs, New Jersey Studio. That's where the magic happened. Mobley starts the album with his magical touch of Irving Berlin's Remember. With a tender, smooth ride, he blows extra gust into as that tune develops the bouncy This I Dig of You. Features Mobley's stunning round tone with Art Blakey's smashing solo break. Kelly established the groove on Dig This that Mobley blows into his laid-back but tasty style. And that is just the highlights of this incredible album, Soul Station by Hank Mobley. Well, I'd like to thank you for watching my video. Hope you're doing well. I wish all the best for you and your family and good health. And this again, this is Joey K, and I will see you on the next one.